he can even be tamed now that I think about it. Oh, stay on the rock. That's talent. That's talent right there. You just what is going on everybody? Right here back with what used to be the Ark Survival Evolved modded series till we lost all our pets and this game started bitch slapping me around like some $2 hooker who I guess does that for a living. I, I, God damn it, I confused myself. So right now, last, last time we played, my goal was to go tame a T-Rex because anything else we fucking tame is just gonna become T-Rex food. It's just the way it is. It's the way it is on the center part of the island, this little innards. Heart sucks ass. This is like the most ghetto neighborhood ever. Just picture just sirens constantly. That's where we're living. Which brings me to my next point. We are going to be leaving this spot very soon. And brings me to my saddest point. We're going to have to leave Zapdos over here. Because he can't ride the boat. It's just not a thing. <laughs> like we we can't just stay here forever because of Zapdos. I mean I love you buddy. But I mean you're going to. We just can't. We'll lose everything repeatedly. Until we just have like a thick lining around- I don't- I don't even know how. We'd have to build some serious defenses. But- But before we do leave- we're not leaving him right now anyways. I'm just prepping you guys. Just bracing. We will build a nice cage around him with a nice little landmark. We'll always know where he is. If anything, we'll put him like in the middle. So we'll- No, that just sounds terrible. We'll have to get him out every freaking time. And then if we ever come inland, which we will a lot, because this is a big major part of the map, then we will bring Zapdos. Maybe one day the dev will make it so- he could ride on rafts, because this this mega raft is glitchy with um, creatures, dinos that can have saddles on them. Like, they can't ride on this raft right now. But, but, but. Oh my god, that face! God damn it! The reminders! I'm so bad at that. I'm so bad at taking my mind off things that make me sad. Ooh. What are these two items? Oh my god, did the Star Wars mod update? I didn't see these before. There was a lot of updating. That's sick. Stormtrooper rank. Customize your rank. I don't even know what that is. And a Stormtrooper backpack. That's, just, <laughs> that's badass, dude. Oh yeah, I remember them mentioning they were going to... Well, one fiber? I love you. That's awesome, dude. You get to have our own little ranked shoulder. I guess that's a happy thing. Wait, I was doing something. Holy shit. Holy attention span. Unholy attention span where I like it. This right here, level 55, that's when you get the barge for the big raft mod. And that thing is capable of holding um, dinos that have platform saddles. So I'm hoping it'll be capable of holding Zapdos over here too. Maybe it'll fix the bug. <laughs> Fuck off! The game broke on me. I'm gonna check this out. Oh, I loved this helmet too, but we have to wear this one a bit just as a memorial. Sweet, so that's our offhand. What is that do? <laughs> Does it have any purpose? Oh, this is sick. This goes on our shoulder. Oh my god. Well, now we just have a stormtrooper front. I don't even mean to do that. That's cool, man. And then you just you just need to paint it to customize your rank, or how's that even? Provides moderate physical protection, but can be a little warm. Can't get a little warm. I need to look into this more. But either way, this is badass, dude. I feel so much better with my stormtrooper backpack. Like official. Like I'm ready to go kill some rebels who are just trying to survive in this terrible, terrible world. Okay, so, I'm just bringing you two bitches with me, since one's security guard and the other is berry collector. We're gonna make some narcotics. Last time I put about five into that guy, so I'm thinking we gotta put a lot more than five. Um, I just, I just hope this is gonna go well, but on the upside, we have nothing to lose, so. And then we just need to start taming a power guy so we could, it's time to make a base, but we have to have that base secured. I can't just be boat people anymore, man, it's no way to live. Alright, well, we've been gathering for a bit. We now have a shit ton of these. I wish I had a little bit more arrows. We're just gonna make all of these. Wait, we need we need a buttload more fiber. Okay, wait. Yup, that's our next- Oh, damn it, I'm encumbered. Alright, come here, Thunder Thighs. Take my shit. <laughs> I just wanna make sure we're very properly prepared. And even though, no matter how prepared we get, I know we're not gonna be that. Damn, I need to tame me a monkey man, like a freaking Bigfoot. This is, I don't wanna gather fiber either. This is all just strenuous stuff that shouldn't be happening. But... Yeah, I just want to be prepared for when we crash and burn and fail in this. <laughs> I'm just kind of adapting to new strategies. I remember when me and um, Arcade would tame our Rex, he would just hold me in his paws, like, flying way over, and I would just shoot down arrows on him. But it's kind of how he tamed all of our big creatures. Except for Rosie, our Spino, but we had, like, five people dropping him with Trank arrows, because it was... We just had more people playing with us at the time. And that was... That was easy living. This running up on your own, shooting arrows in their face stuff really backfires a lot more than you think it would. I mean, every single time. <laughs> I'm just playing it safe here when I'm thinking we need at least, at least like 25, maybe 30 of these freaking Anunnaki arrows. Like we just, it's just, 
I mean, every time I always overestimate my enemies, they go down in like a couple arrows, but that Rex, I really thought that Rex was gonna go down a couple arrows, man. Everything else had, that Karna went down in like two or three. So I just, I just, I just assumed I shouldn't have assumed. Never assume in life over important things. Is that expression? <clears throat> Assumptions make an ass out of you and me. It definitely made an ass out of myself. I can't, that whole video kind of haunted me. I even sat down and talked to my mom about it. I needed some therapeutic release from watching that whole nightmare just take place. It's weird how much this game is emotionally, I don't know, attaching itself to me. It's getting way too intense. Okay, so now how many can we make? 21? Oh, that's like right under my standard number, but I guess it's still a start and then we'll just get a few more. That's what we gotta do, man. We still have nine normal Trank arrows, but those don't really do shit, so... <laughs> shit, see, this is what I wanted to avoid. I wanted to, I'm like out of bushes all over this area now for the most part. So I'm having to move inland where everything is... Oh, is that a bright green Quetzal? That thing is gorgeous. Oh my god, it's the prettiest thing ever. It's like a sign of hope right there. Or a sign of death. I don't know, it might be a death omen or a hope omen. I'm not too familiar with my omens, but... I like to think it's a good thing. I like to think one day we'll have that exact Quetzal tamed. I mean, not right now, clearly, because I don't know how the fuck to get up there, but... <laughs> But in some distant future. Uh, we are definitely in a bad neighborhood. Let's head down the hill a little bit. This is... It's the worst time of the day to be around here, too. It's like this kind of dark nighttime. It's, it's like... It's all the creatures that we're supposed to hunt and eat all day are now realizing they fucked up and they have to go find food right now. And that's right where we're gonna be. I think that's... <laughs> I think that's how nature thinks it through, right? That's how, like, creatures hunt. That exact thought process. Alright, we've got to at least be looking at another 10, which is, would put us in 30, all we need in life for the most part. So, what are we looking at? Oh, another 14! Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there. Grabbed a bunch of shit I doth need, but still, I need to go drop a bunch of stuff up off at the boat, actually, because we just have way too much shit. And if we get over and covered on this journey, life is just over as we know it. Hell yeah, dude! Alright, we stand a chance at recovery right now. It could happen. I mean, we could always recover. We still have freaking. We still have it, like. I mean, I guess, now that I think about it, we don't have that much. We have friends, though. We have allies. All you need is a couple friends and, you know, some Moby Dick in your life and you're good. Oh my god, my death perception is so shit right now. The game froze the worst time. This dragonfly right here, I thought for a second, was a mega one on that beach way over there. Like that, that just blew my mind. God, I'm just looking through my chest and I see this right here, direwolf face mask. We all know who that's a tribute to. It's just gonna forever be sad to me until we eventually move past it, which I don't think will ever happen. Pretty sure we're just gonna be sad about that forever. <laughs> it's... Oops, my, my bad dog. Get that in there. I'm just repairing some shit before I head out and just, I don't know, get obliterated for the most part. Oh man, I just feel like we could be so much more protected in this kind of mission. Like, there's things we need. We need speed buffs, dude. Speed buffs like a mofo. I need to get on my potion game. I need to get the hell on my st- Okay, we need fire. I can't be in darkness anymore. Alright, now before we go, one more thing. Before I just go around the corner and possibly get my face blown off. Just gonna put you right there next to you. We need to collect those helmets, if anything. Those need to be protected for shizzle. So I should repair you. Yeah, I'll definitely just go with this one right now, because it's- it's a- I just put it in the chest, didn't I? I just put it in the chest. It's a pretty fancy mask, and, um, I just don't want to wear any dead pets into battle because there's a chance we lose them, and then it's just so sad. You gotta keep those things intact, you know? Alright, looks like we're just about ready to head out. Godspeed, everybody. We look pretty damn formidable. I know we're just looking at my crotch right now, but still. Oh, we have to wait through the damn nighttime. Crap! This is like the prettiest night sunset. It's those smoke clouds over there make it so much better. Okay, so now we're gonna go around the corner and we're gonna go, or should we just go up the hill? I think we should go that way. And we're just gonna go find somebody who looks like we can tame them and they won't just get killed by the first predator that we bring them back home to. Look at this quest voyage right here. We look so ready. We're just like so many different genres and aspects. <laughs> I don't even know, man. We're a stormtrooper with some other badass helmet on a golden dodo riding around looking to tame T-Rexes. I think my life is going pretty good right now. Even with all the recent casualties, you kind of just gotta be happy about the little things or you're just gonna be fucked. Really, really, really hoping that we don't just run into one because this is the last thing on the planet I could outrun one in. Like, I, I, I don't know how that would go down actually. 
now that I ponder it. I feel like I would get off, get killed, the dodo would start fighting him as I- Is that a Rex? Is that that Rex that was there last time or did his ass move? Oh god. And that's a Bronto, okay. <laughs> so what the fuck does that tail belong to? Oh my god! Oh my god, I found Foxtrot! No way! No freaking way, dude! No way! I can't believe we found Foxtrot, he was so close! Dude, there's been so many predators all over this area too, how do you survive over here in the bushes randomly? But you don't survive... Come on, buddy, you gotta fly! Take flight, Foxtrot! Are you injured? Are you hungry, buddy? I can't believe he's alive, dude! I can't believe he's alive! I didn't say he was dead, but still, I'd assume. You got plenty of food. Come on, take flight, buddy. You're just a child. Your whole family was slaughtered. You abandoned home and have been hiding in a bush ever since. This is the saddest thing ever. This is just, this, I can't believe the impact of all that is still hitting me. Like, it's not even done yet. <laughs> no, 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 no! Oh my god, 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 Holy crap, let's just finally you're flying though. If that's that's all it took to get you in the air, hell yeah. You just had to get attacked a little bit? I've been whistling my ass off. Sweet Zapdos, you can get your ass over here on your own sweet time. That's that's, that's just fine. You're you're chilling, you're basically a demigod, I'm not too worried about it. Foxtrot, you poor little ad adolescent. If I fly into the water right now, are you gonna go into the water? Who's fighting who? Who's fighting who? Why is the music popping off? What's happening? Zapdos, are you facing freaking- Oh my god, is there a bunch of piranhas in the water right now? I can't go through this again! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! Damn it! Damn it, I shot them! Come here, come here, I should not have shot them. Should not have shot the bullet. I'm just freaking out right now. And that's a Carno over there. Oh my god, I hate these flashbacks! There is, there's the buttload of piranha in the water right now. Okay, goody. Goody gumdrops, just a perfect example of why we need to get the freaking hell out of this place, man. We can't survive here much longer. Every like 15 minutes or so, a predator comes around that's just too damn powerful. And I just can't, I can't live with it anymore, man. I can't live with it anymore. <laughs> I gotta, gotta get out of this hell hole. I'm sorry, Zapdos. This just gotta be a thing, man. Come on, Zapdos. Oh, Zapdos. Come on, Foxtrot. You can do it, buddy. You can do it. Perfect, perfect. Just land right onto the boat. Perfect. Just set down, come on. Come on, buddy. How did I get him on here before? Shit, I can't even remember, he like walked on. You know what, Zapdos? We're gonna go get this Carno bastard. D -d -d you didn't even move in health, that was a ripoff. That was malarkey, that shouldn't have happened right there. I feel offended by that. Okay, you guys are fine right there for the most part. You're really not, we need to get the hell out of here. This whole place is just ghetto as shit. <laughs> All right, this Carno's officially getting too close for comfort. He just walked back over to that side, but he like walked right here a minute ago. Can't have it. Can't have it. Hopefully they don't get involved. I just whistled for them all to stay passive, but even I've seen that backfire so many damn times. Just don't even know what to think anymore. Can you spot him from here? Oh, you can, you, you wonderful bitch. I'm never too worried about Zapdos, cause like, it's a freaking golden dodo. It should be fine against anything, right? Theoretically? Come on, buddy, you're just about the size of him, too. Whoa, bitch! Get the fuck away from me! This was supposed to be a fight between you two. I shouldn't have gotten involved. I wanted to see the outcome. Oh, small experience potion and a medium experience potion. That's fan-fucking-tastic right there. I'm gonna level something up a lot once I decide what to love next. What is this? It's like a medium-sized morph. Oh, it's an adolescent elite. Oh, you're gonna grow up to be a big crazy bastard, aren't you? Now I promised myself I wasn't gonna tame anything that could die, but it's like right here, it's gonna be so easy because it's a kid. It's gonna grow up to be awesome. What do we do here? What do we do here? What do we do here? I'm gonna need something to fly around with. Let's just not get too emotionally attached. See? One arrow. Miss! Douchebag! Are you really not asleep yet? You're a child! <laughs> okay, this guy's just gonna be- No, 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 you fucking idiot! No, no, no! Stop! Stop it! You dumb piece of shit! I shouldn't have had him on following! Oh my god, he was following me. That was such a waste of time and emotion. Okay, clearly that happened for a reason. I'm an idiot being the reason, but still, we're gonna act like the universe wanted it to happen. Yo, there's that green monkey! What's up, bitch? What's up? What's, 
Damn you and your fast old bastard! Oh my god, this monkey is like the, the, the freaking speed of sound. Sonic monkey. Am I supposed to kill you even? I think I can't tame you unless I put like... No, I don't know. Let's say put meat in the last thing in your inventory. What the hell am I even doing shooting an emerald pygmy? You find something rare and beautiful and you fill it with shotgun shells. You're what's wrong with the world, bro. You are what is wrong with the... What do we do with you? Do I, like, put a flare up its ass or something? That doesn't feel right. What do you think, Zapdos? Just keep hitting it? I'm confused. I've never come across an emerald pygmy. I feel like I'm not supposed to know what to do in this situation. I mean, usually I'd say tame it, but I don't think we can. I just, I've seen the, the Genesis mod page before, and I'm pretty sure these, these, these treasure monkeys you can't tame. So, it doesn't look like you can kill them either, though, actually. I'm confused what the hell we're supposed to be doing here. See, you put a trach arrow in them, nothing happens. I'll put like three in them just because of how often you come across an emerald pygmy. Except every episode now for some reason. So I'm just, I'm just 99% sure you're not supposed to tame them or like, what, what is the purpose of you monkey? What the hell? I'll just leave you non at that monkey, Zapdos. You tell me how that goes. So we only have 28 of these left. So we gotta use them wisely. I guess it's still more than I've ever had, but I mean, things can go south so fast. You still not into that monkey, Zapdos? Good boy. Look at this holy ass place. This is beautiful. Oh my god, the kind of place you can only access from the center of the island. Extremely lack and dinos though, if I do say so much. I pictured way more. We got like a couple trikes and some sarco. What the hell? I bet if I walked like a hundred feet farther in, then so many would just start spawning, but I'm gonna go find Zapdos, cause I'm a little worried what's going on there. You know what we do with him, Zapdos? We leave him. We leave him to just continue his emerald madness in that corner right there. Not even worry about it. Dude, what the fuck are up with these pygmies? What the hell? Hey, what, hey, as soon as this Bronto moves its legs, you can see what I'm talking about. There's a bright purple one right over there too. Like, what the, what the hell is even going on here? <laughs> I'm so confused with creatures. Oh my god, you adorable little fart. What is going on, little guy? Damn it, I just want to tame him so bad, but that can go so wrong. We all know how bad that's gonna be. He's gonna turn into freaking lamb chops. What's going on, handsome? But this thing's just such a cute little baby goat. I almost can't even... I mean, he's by far the most harmless, worthless, deadweight creature around here. I almost just took your kid, bro. You gotta watch out for that shit. You know, your kid just wandering around like that. It's ghetto-ass neighborhood. Giant scorpions and whatnot. Come here, dude. Give me them free narcotics. Call these guys drug stores because I hold them up for their stuff. This guy's got a lot of help. Oh, no way. Lazarus powder and eight narcotics. That's such a come up right there. Now we can hold our breath in the water. What in the hell is that thing in the air over there? I don't even... I, not even getting into it. I'm pretty sure that floating body over there is our, our Demorphodon we were going to catch. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. I'm not, I can't exactly testify, but I'm 99% sure. Alright, come on, Zapdos. We're going to go around the corner and tame something crazy or kill something crazy. It's like a total win-win, because -win, even if you just kill them, they drop so much cool shit sometimes. Dude, this is where that Sarko den was. Like, this is where their family was hiding. That's so sad. They just kept crawling out one by one. I wonder if you could defeat a Spino. That would be quite the feat to pull off. Oh my god, I wish we had Banshee so bad. I would just fly right up on that thing and just shoot arrows down at him. He's such a perfect life. Okay, that's a raptor. Easy does it. Easy does it around these types. They tend to be very big assholes. Are you just a standard raptor? Oh, girl, you ain't nothing special. What in the fuck is that thing? What is that Satan recreation over there? Gonna get your ass across the water. You're a bird, you better have a bottom heavy ass. Is that a. Look at that wolf over there, dude! Look at those green stripes all over. That thing is straight from hell. Oh my god. There's so many ways this could go wrong, but so many ways it could go right as well. Right, come on, get out of here, you random ass normal raptor. You ain't special, girl. Oh, yeah, yeah, nah, you ain't special. Alright, Dodo, I'm gonna need you to wait your ass here. I need you to wait your ass on peaceful, alright? I, I don't care if you have to die. You don't take, you don't do any damage, you don't follow me, you don't do nothing. You have no rights around here! 
If I could get this wolf down, that would be so fucking cool. I don't even care if I... No! No, the Spino! The Spino's gonna kill my wolf! Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, Johnny. You're better than that. Fuck off! Okay. <laughs> Anything I can do to help my guy out over there. I don't care if he kills me, but I want to kill... I mean, I want to tame him. Look at that guy. He tore through that Spino. One arrow in. Two arrows in. Are we hitting him or the Spino? Fuck. I can't tell. We're definitely hitting him there. I wonder if he could even be tamed now that I think about it. Oh, stay on the rock. That's talent. That's talent right there. You just- ah! You bitch! He immediately knocks me out! No, 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 my god! Oh my god, I can't do shit against this guy! He's just eating me! Holy fuck! Oh my god, a badass dire wolf. Now that's the future right there. A badass dire wolf. Just tore through my ass like tissue paper. I honestly didn't think he'd be able to get me up on that rock. He was. He was very able to. So the thing about those guys, there's there's like the snow, there's the ones that freeze, there's the ones that set you on fire, there's the ones that instantly drop you. That was one of those ones. As you could probably tell, he instantly put my ass to sleep. I very much so underestimated his power. He got up on that rock and I was asleep in fucking seconds, dude. In seconds! I wonder if he could put... I wonder if he could put the golden dodo to sleep. I'd like to test that out. Yeah, but not right now. See, I, no, no watch on my wrist. I, I know I got time to lose everything I care about. Dude, what a douchebag. I don't even know how to, how to deal with this guy. Like, how do you deal with this kind of creature? What's your torpor, buddy? Okay, 11,000. You should be good. I just want him dead now. We can't tame him, so we must kill him. If we can tame him, it's not gonna be right now. It's not gonna be for a long time. This is like finding a legendary right when you start playing Pokemon. And thinking you can tame it, and then... No! Get that son of a bitch! Attack him! Attack him! Attack him! Attack him! Attack him! You stupid dodo, you fuck! I'm not even gonna witness the fight now! Oh my god, oh my god, get me back to the goddamn game. Come on, come on. Of course, of course I have to run to it. Of course I forgot to make more beds. I always forget to make more beds. Dude, 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 dude. Dude, thank god I've been getting my stamina. There he is! He's fighting him right fucking in front of us! Oh my god, please win! Please beat that bastard! You're our last time. What are we gonna do if we lose him? I mean, sure, we could tame another one with like 50 or like 20 minutes and a stack of berries, but still, it's the thought, you know? You guys named him. He's part of the family! Come on, Zapdos. Come on, you son of a bitch. We can't just lose people so many episodes in a row. Did you kill him? <laughs> Did you kill him, buddy? Because that'd be pretty fantastic if you did. Or did you guys just make amends and then he disappeared over the distance? Is that what happened? I need to know what happened, you son of a bitch. Let me look at your inventory. Because he okay, leveled up. I'd assume you level up. He didn't even get anything fancy. He got a bow. A primitive bow. I'm very confused how the fuck this resolved. How did this happen? Of course you have full health. You regenerate. Where did the wolf go? Tell me what happened, Zapdos. This is stupid. I deserve answers. I deserve to know. 0.3%, that's all we go up. What is life by movement speed? There we go. 2%, that's a little better. All right, well that was a weird little side bump. Thank God we have this guy with us, so that would have just been so tragic. That is a big ass Oviraptor. Is that unusually big or am I just tripping? I'm pretty sure that's a fucking huge ass Oviraptor. <laughs> that thing's super cool. Man, I have nothing. I have nothing. I'm just a pantsless stormtrooper. Look like I just got out of Kylo Ren's naughty chamber or something. Okay, so I really want to tame this guy. I mean, he's fancy. He's definitely a prize, but... I mean, he's also going to be delicious for the enemy, and that's kind of what I want to avoid here. That badass direwolf that killed us, that exact one. A drink one, a poison one, because there's badass poison raptors too that put things to sleep so fast. Like, I've tested it. They put, you can put a T-Rex to sleep in like three bites. That is just a scary looking Spino. But that wolf, dude, a, a badass, a badass venomous dire wolf. I thought you were following me, you shit. You were my bodyguard. That, that guy would just put so many people to sleep in like one or two bites. Nothing would ever be able to kill it. Man, this just disappoints the hell out of me. Because if we could have gotten up there, if we could have flown up there, then we could have just, we could have just shot down on him and tamed his ass so easy. You are unnaturally big, sir. It's freaking me out. That would have just been so golden. It could have been so easy with Banshee. So now it's hitting me. We need to tame another Elite Dimorphodon. 
and just give it like some some stormtrooper name so we don't even get emotionally attached to it like 21897 or something like that and then and then um and then just use him to tame things and we can't be upset when he dies because it will happen and we just can't we just fucking can't be upset anymore I just can't <laughs> like afraid to tame things now because everything gets eaten oh hell nah bitch you come around here with that attitude wait what the hell just jumped over that rock so what is a raptor? I'm confused. It looked really big and really small for a second. Look at that fiery little turd running around. What is he thinking? What is he thinking? I don't even want to tame him because I've even had my heart broken by raptors now. Oh, he just looks scared and confused like a child. He doesn't even know what's going on. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. Don't worry. It's all right. I'll take you home. He's an orphaned baby raptor. We have to do it. I just feel bad at this point. This adolescent little rat isn't even here. He can't find food on his own. We, oh my god, this is how it happens! I'm about to get emotionally attached again to a fucking raptor. A raptor of all things. What am I doing? Stop caps locking, you idiot. Come on, buddy. This is taking forever. I thought you children were supposed to be easy. A little female child. God, this is just so... I'm just single dad, not prepared for this, man. It's crazy how many bastard parents there are in the animal kingdom. Like, the amount of children running around. Just no... No... No civil obedience whatsoever. I don't even know what the hell to call it. This whole place is a freaking shit show. You're so close. You're so close, little buddy. I just need to get you on the boat so we can safely... I don't know. End the episode? There's, there's, there's safely doing shit around here. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. There's no such thing as safely anything. I'm just happy we got that freaking dire wolf out of here. Because he was eventually going to wander over into our base and ruin everything. And we are not going to be able to... I just You know what I can't freaking wait for? What I can't wait for is this right here. The photon rifle. This right here, the photon rifle, is when we'll be able to tame so many motherfuckers that are just so hard to acquire. We just need angler gel, metal ingot, and obsidian. We just need angler gel for the most part. Maybe I should start thinking about this strategically and plan it out. Like, now I should just try and tame Sarkos, make a fish army, go get the angler gel. I think that's what we should be doing. Okay, never mind. No doubt we got you. What the hell? Didn't even say. Well, welcome to the club, little buddy. Now, since Chris Pratt loves naming raptors after people, I think I'm gonna name this raptor after Chris Pratt, but seeing as how it's a female, that wouldn't exactly work. So I think we're just gonna do Christina Pratt. There we go. Come on, Christina. Come on, girl. There we go. You see, I don't mean to drop the negative bomb, but you notice I named her. And I didn't ask you guys to name her. You might be able to guess why that is. It seems redundant to just say it every time now. Come on, buddy. Get you on the boat. You know what, though? Eventually, when we do have a base and we do have a safe land, just a huge fenced-off area, saving these creatures, these kids right here, will come and it'll, it'll just feel good in the end. Come on, Christina. Get over here. Christina, get your bitch ass on over here, lady. Oh, my God. I like her. I think she's a nice addition to the team. Completely useless, no point whatsoever, but I just saw her as a kid who needed help, and that's why we that's why we had to do it, man. Let's get a nice selfie going on here. Should put some pants on, shit. <laughs> See, that's a pretty badass team right there. Still just a child. So next episode, forget T-Rexes. Fuck them, just... If anything, they're pinatas right now. We should kill them and take what items we could get. And let's just get an army of Sarkos. And then take this boat on over to the water. Find us some angler gel. Make one of these rifles, and then we'll be able to tame so many things. Because it's just, like, a powerful tranquilizing rifle with, with scope that shoots a photon beam to shock, paralyze, and knock out enemies. Needs a photon core per shot. Which aren't that... Wait, I haven't unlocked photon cores. So we'll just... We'll worry about that shit. I think that's it, actually. So, yeah, that's our goal, man. Sarko Army. Oh my god, but it's just, there's nothing we can do though, no, oh my, because then I think about all the mega megalodon, the badass megalodons, the badass freaking Moses, it's just, it's just gonna go so bad either, no matter where we go on this land, we're gonna get dick slapped by Ark Survival Evolved, but I guess that's the point of the game, so yeah, if you guys had a good time watching, make sure to smack that like button, subscribe for more, and have a nice day guys, peace!